You can go, guy. <laughs> this guy is too busy looking at my back. He doesn't realize he can go. <laughs> Why does this always happen? <sighs> that happens to me at least once every day. Just suddenly have to stop because the light turned red. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice, thanks. He likes my camera. <laughs> Again, <laughs> every time. <laughs> All right, so twenty-two thousand three hundred miles, and three thousand miles to the next old change. So my next old change is at twenty-five thousand three hundred miles. I don't know. Maybe someone can tell me how often they change their oil. I usually try and change it every 3,000 miles, but the manual for my bike actually says every 4,000 miles. So, I don't know. I could just go in between and just change it every 3,500 miles. I guess that works. Why am I slowing down so much? See, like, I'm... <laughs> I already think the traffic light is just gonna change red on me, so I just instinctively slow down now. I think you should always slow down for a traffic light, or even if it's green, but then that's just how I was. Like, back home in Nigeria, which is where I'm from, uh, it doesn't matter if the light is green, man. You slow down at a traffic light because there's someone who's always gonna be crazy and just run the red light. I mean, not all the time, but it does happen fairly often. It's weird because back home as well, there's this mentality that traffic lights are only for cars, not for motorcycles. So like, every time you see motorcycles running red lights, they, they, like they ride around with no gear anyway, and I'm like, you guys are just risking your lives for no reason. Like it's so bad, even the police officers that are on duty like around the traffic lights If they see a nice bike pull up and the light is red but there's no cars coming on the other side They'd be like, go! It has actually happened to a relative of mine before But yeah, this place that I'm about to pull up to In my opinion at least, if you're, if you're in like the Melbourne, Florida area And you own a motorcycle And you don't do your own servicing by yourself bring it here man because these guys are just great guys I've looked up rates of what other people charge for the same stuff that they do here and it's just pretty much I feel like if you're not coming here you're getting ripped off and as usual <laughs> this is like the fourth time I've done this like literally this is like the fourth time I've done this and I always feel so stupid they aren't open on Mondays and I always think they're open on Mondays even though I know fully well that they aren't open on Mondays so I ride all the way here and I just have to go back because they're not open on Mondays feels good man this is like the fourth time I've done this they're open on Tuesdays through Saturdays and then they're closed on Sunday and Monday and I always come here <sighs> You know what, I'm gonna go this way Cause this, at least this is a nicer ride back home But yeah, this is probably one of the more relaxing roads to ride on in this area <sighs> Feels good I can't turn here but it's not this turn that I usually turn on from. Is it? Wait, is it? I think it might be. No, 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 no. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Uh, I don't know if I'll 
make this. I hope I'll make this. I'm not gonna make this. Ah! <laughs> the third time today. <laughs> oh, the third time today, man. Not even the third time today. The third time this ride. I just miss it. Hey! I'm behind Batman. I don't know if you can see, but this guy's by some straight says Batman. But like, B-A-T-M-H-A-N? <laughs> Batman. Right? That's all that says. Alright. Make sure nothing is leaking. That had better be water. It looks like water. Yeah, yeah that's water. Whew. That was scary for a second. That's fine. That's fine. Just very, very hot. Yeah, I think I am good.